the NFL has joined the growing group of sellers looking to cash in on this underdog craze. Eagles players Chris Long and Lane Johnson are selling underdog t-shirts to benefit Philly schools and now they're challenging the league to do the same thing. Our Joe Holden joins us now from school district headquarters in Spring Garden with the latest developments in this story. Joe. Jess Yuki and we went asking, asking the NFL for answers after they came out with an underdog t-shirt of their own. Remember, Chris Long and Lane Johnson were taking the proceeds from their own t-shirt and donating 100% to the school district. Well, apparently the NFL bowing to pressure after an offensive Philadelphia social media campaign was launched. NFL ripoff? This, shall we say, official underdog T-shirt had ruffled the feathers of a few eagles. And for them to take their idea to make money for themselves, I think it's a joke. Houston Tuminello is Lane Johnson's manager. They've been swamped with orders for their underdog T-shirt. You know, the one inspired by Johnson and Chris Long's mask-wearing celebration after trampling the Falcons. It seems the NFL at first in fun on Monday tweeted at Long to check out its version of the T thus sparking a firestorm and a tale of two t-shirts. Uh, I think it's low class of them to do that, to take their idea, which Chris and Lane, they had the idea and they what they, uh, you know, they want to give it to a charity. What really upset the fan base, while 100% of profits from Johnson and long shirts would go to Philadelphia schools, the NFL was silent on what it would do with the cash from its sales. It just seems like they're taking ideas, trying to make profit off it, which is particularly bad with the underdog thing. Do the right thing. I mean, they're going to make it for the, for the charity, do that, but don't, don't do like some fake stuff. Perhaps bowing to pressure, the NFL confirmed just before five, 100% of the profit from its shirts would now go to Philly schools. And there are some even better ideas ahead. If we can bring the championship to the city of Philadelphia, I think we got a much better chance of getting the help and things that we need. Sounds good. And CBS 3 broke word of this development from the NFL online. Chris Long and I were chatting over Twitter. Lane Johnson adding to the discussion. They really appreciate the NFL getting on board and donating the proceeds to the Philadelphia School District. Now, we should add, as for Chris Long and Lane Johnson, they will have a new, refreshed version of the underdog T-shirt. They're still working on the design, but I understand it will be available for sale by Friday. Friday. Once again, all going to benefit Philadelphia school children. That's the latest live in the Spring Garden section of Philadelphia. Joe Holden, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. New and refreshed. Looking forward to that. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, Joe. Now, if you want